Last time I was with all of you youngins, one of you youngins says to me, she says, this is what she says, and she says, Mr. Dawson, can you draw Tweety Bird? Can you draw Tweety Bird? And of course my answer to her was, I can draw anything I can see, just like all of you. I can draw anything that I can see. Now, one nifty thing is that I happen to have this cool book, which is Warner Brothers Animation Art. Now, the reason that I picked up this book is because it has what you call model sheets in it. So here's the model sheet for Tweety Bird. This was done by Bob Clampett, very famous director of Warner Brothers cartoons. You see that? So it's Tweety, but then it's Tweety from all different directions and a bunch of different poses. See that? Now, when you're making a cartoon, you have to have 18 pictures per second. All right, so for a seven minute cartoon, 18 times 60 is about, I don't know, 800, and then uh, you gotta have uh, something like 5,600 uh, pictures, individual pictures. So you can't have somebody sit down and just draw, <laughs> draw pictures. So they make these model sheets to give to people that they call in-betweeners. The director, might draw Daffy Duck going, aha! And then the next picture is going, mm -hmm, like this. So the director of the cartoon draws this picture and this picture, and the in-betweeners draw all the pictures going, right there. So when you get started as a professional artist, you often start as an in-betweener. So I have all these great poses for Tweety that I can use, and I took this as an opportunity to draw in a variety of different styles. So this is the kind of drawing we do with pencils here. Yeah. But again, I was looking at the lead sheet, so I, I had something to go off of. This is how Leonardo da Vinci might have drawn Tweety Bird, because he would use Conte crayon on some kind of parchment. This is Tweety. Oh, he's so cute. That's Tweety in crayon. Just using crayons. Now the particular student who asked me, I happen to know, does gymnastics. So I was able to look at the lead sheet. There wasn't a picture of Tweety doing gymnastics, but by looking at all the poses, all the different ways, I was able to say, well, he'd probably look like this if he was on the balance beam. And then this is drawing just with Sharpies. Okay. One of the things I never realized when I was younger is that when artists draw for comic strips or what have you, they use very different tools than you might use drawing at your desk, just pencils and, and stick pens, right? Ballpoint pens up there. What professional artists generally use are either, uh, they use India ink with a pen that you dip into the ink. They've got a variety of points that they can use with it. So it's a very different effect than you can get with a ballpoint or with a pencil. Why don't we draw today? Would that be fun? Yeah. Yeah, I think that we ought to warm up with draw your cake and eat it too. That's what I think so. It's been two weeks, hasn't it? Two painful weeks where I did not get to be drawing with my favorite people in the world who are, in fact, you. So, yay! People are so pretty. So, go ahead and do your four shortened circle, pull down your sides. Of course, you're going to put a 
smile on the bottom of the cake. Now he gives you a guide dot right there in the center. You need this job, it's easy. Okay. Now from that point, you can cut out a wedge. Some of you might like a thin wedge. I have to have a big one. And from the end points of that wedge, pull the lines straight down. If I knew you were coming, I'd draw the cake. And you can take out these lines at the top and bottom and add the, the wedgy part down here. Give your cake a wedgie. And add some candles. You can add three or four or six or ten or sixteen. Sixteen candles. Wah, 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 wah. Make a lovely light. Wah, 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 wah. But not as bright. Wah, 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 wah. 50s music, kids. 50s music was popular in the 50s, and then for some reason, 50s music was popular again in the 70s. In the 1970s, it was a time of great turmoil where people got their hair permed to be very curly. Oh, yeah. Boy, there were some poodle looking dudes in my school. Let me show you. You ever see the Brady Bunch? Yes. Everybody, everybody's hair looked like the Brady Bunch, not mine. My hair's always looked pretty much like it looks now. It never looked all that good. Yeah, when you got hair like mine, going bald is a mixed blessing, kids. Why? You can add some loopy icing to your cake. And what are we going to do inside the cake here? Might we? Yeah. Oh, she's oh, oh yeah, yeah. Go, babe. Uh huh. Hey, guess who friended me on Facebook? Just yesterday. I told you to guess. Uh, no, he won't re reply to any of my friend requests. Good. 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 Mark, Mark Kistler friended me yesterday. Do we see all these drawing lessons we're doing? This drawing book? Mark Kistler. Why would I lie about that? I don't know. Every time I just think that my mom's people lie to me a lot. He does. Yes. Well, I shouldn't why do that. Don't you tell your mom? I think she knows that. Well, and I'll we'll throw a little shadow down here. Those of you who have the Facebook and have friended me, you can go up. You can see a picture of me with Mark Kistler when we made the TV show about ten years ago. Yeah, I saw it. Did you see it? Yeah. My brother. My brother. I asked him if I can go on to see it. To see your picture. Ah, yes. Mm -hmm. I just posted uh, pictures of me working at Disneyland in my clown costume and pictures of me at Great America when I was a singing, dancing fool. And you can go see those on the YouTubes. Oh, no, on the uh, Facebook. One of those things. If you have friended me. Get your parents' permission, kids. Okay. And. No! Well, everybody, make a wish, blow out my picture. One, two, three. Keep it there. Keep it there. Have my wish.
boys and girls, it is a very Zen experience. Zen, Zen is living in the moment. Don't worry about what you ate for breakfast or think about what you're having for dinner. Just enjoy your lunch, kids. Okay. What do you want to draw? Draw squid. Draw squid. So we start with a parabolic shape. Parabola. And he's got a couple of eyes up here, and they're overlapping. So one is close to you, and it's on this side of his parabolic shape. The other one is on the opposite side. So you're going to overlap his body on his eye, too. And he's looking quizzically this way, so we're going to put some pupils looking quizzically that way. Then we give him some tentacules. Got his tentacles akimbo here. When you cross your arms like that, you call that arms akimbo. I don't know why. That's, that's just what it's called. I don't make up words, kids. I just use them. Well, I make up some words. Like tentacule is exactly right. You like that? Yeah. You know what I'm doing? I'm making. Uh, I, I, that, I'm taking that from uh, Mr. Magoo's Christmas Carol. Oh, oh yeah. Have you ever seen that? Yeah. They do a they do a song where they do a lot of words like that. Where referee. Pensibles will steal your pens and pensibles. That one. So I do that every now and again. So there we go. You can keep adding tentacles if you'd like. And of course, we're going to shade. We love the shade, 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 shade. We love the shade, 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 shade. We love the shade, 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 shade. Uh huh. We love the shade. La da 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 da. Who bought the shade? Do do do. Who bought the shade? Bump bump bump. Rock rock and needle. Bump bump bump. Bump bump a doo da. Uh huh. We love the shade. Yeah, keep going. I love it. If I do get together with Mr. Kiss one of 
this weekend. I'm going to make a point of showing him some video, and he can see you kids singing the song properly. <laughs> our homework last time? I believe it was Cube Land, Cube World. Who's got a Cube World for me? All right. Hmm? Okay. Uh-huh. This is, this is the, uh, the world that landed doors. And Block City, yeah. Lovely. Well, what? What? Ah, there we go. Yeah. I like it very much.